Good morning, happy Tuesday, happy Tuesday, Alexa Penavega, happy Tuesday, Alexa, hey, she's not having it, I'm cutting coupons for You're Costco, cutting Costco coupons, um, I'm here editing the, the, the last few of the um, cruise vlogs, and man, it is sad, Reliving all this stuff because it was so much fun. Although um, I will say it inspired me to cook a more variety, like wide variety. All, here. all this? Me being on the cruise. Oh, being on the cruise did. Oh, well, good. Good. We should go on cruises more often. Get you to be inspired for cooking. You know what I'm saying? I even went online and She's checked out like a new special um, uh, ultimate grocery list. <laughs> wow. Off things that we don't need, but things that I'm going to get. I'm very proud of you. You. Remember, we don't need any kale. Because we grow It's going to be a great day. It is 7.37. We got up at 6.30. We watched a little bit of Cutthroat Kitchen Camp Cutthroat uh, on TV. We woke ourselves up a little bit, and now we're we're in full swing. Penavega House uh, is in full swing. How's Ocean doing? He was kicking me this morning, but I think he went back to sleep. There you go. He's back. To, he's, he's sleeping. Hopefully, he sleeps that much when he's out of the belly. Right? You know, but um, time to edit. Hope you guys are great. So we just found out that Costco doesn't open until 10 o'clock. Babe, how do you feel about that? I'm really frustrated. I have a lot that I needed to do today. She's in. And I wanted to be done. She's out. She's in. By 10. She's out. But now I can't start Costco until 10. So I'll at least be able to go to the grocery store. Yeah. Um, but for the next hour, I'm going to email the car guy. You're going to hang with me? <laughs> My goal is to finish four vlogs and be caught up so we can continue our daily. Eyeballs. Eyeballs? I opened my eye and your hair went right in front of oh, my I'm eyeballs. So cloudy. I'm so cloudy. I'm sorry that you have to edit all this by yourself. Oh my gosh, don't be. Thank you for my cool little birthday present. I'm obsessed with it. Wait, I have a question for you. What? Since you're going to be editing and whatnot, does that mean I'm taking the camera to vlog for the day? Yep. Uh, yeah, because I'm not going to do anything fun. I mean, it's fun, but... Did you nothing, hear that? Nothing entertaining. <laughs> oh gosh. No, I'm just kidding. What? Is there a meal that you're, you'd be like, wow, if you could make me this this week? Yeah. What is it? Yeah. Yeah. What is it? Yeah. Okay. I have no idea. Maybe a stew? Um, I love my chilies. So the chili again? Yeah. It's so easy to make. I would love it's to It's easy that. to make? Yeah. I love her so much. What about like a... Beef stew or is no? Is that too hearty? No, it's great. What, like with carrots and vegetables? You were using that crock pot for a minute that I bought you. <laughs> you said I haven't used it in a while. Yeah. I was just a little worried. She was like, I need the supplies. I was like, I got a crock pot, I got a rice cooker, I got a fryer. No, she got me a fryer. Well, I don't know how her. to use the rice cooker. Well, we should definitely do some rice fried rice chicken rice. again, though. Oh, so Should we take it to John's house? So, okay, so John, we're bringing the fryer well, over. Okay, so we're taking a break as this computer figures itself out because it's being weird. And Alexa and I were doing what we do uh, right after the cruise. We like always put our cards, so we save our, our room keys, and I'm putting them back uh, in the pile, but we always take them out and just look at them again and remember all the different trips that, that we went on. So look at this. Our amazing memories. These are all the room keys. So we have, this was the first cruise that we ever, ah! This was the first cruise that we ever went on, on December 22nd, 2012. Look at this celebrity reflection. And then we got uh, the, let's see. That was so fun. So we got the celebrity reflection, Allure, Oasis. Uh, so this was our first cruise uh, alone, because that was with my family. This was the Oasis for our engagement cruise on August 17th. That was fun. That was a good time. And then uh, we took a cruise to our wedding on the Norwegian Star. Probably will never do that one again. Um, <laughs> this was a, this was the allure uh, with our friends, and then this was the allure with more friends. Oh, that was the Halloween one. Wow! So we've done the allure five times. Uh, this was a Quantum uh, pre-inaugural. This one was our Independence before Dancing with the Stars. This one was when I went uh, on Anthem with Dancing with the Stars. 
This one was Anthem with Alexa in in March, and then I went back with Alec and did the um, the the fitness fitness uh, uh, videos. And this was uh, Harmony of the Seas uh, pre-inaugural. This was Harmony of the Seas, and then we just did a lure for a week and a lure for another week. Man, I love our little cards. I wonder if, like, by the time we're 50, if we're just gonna have like a massive stack. I would assume so. I love cruising. It's great. Well. Do you have a giant box of pretzels still over there? I do. Please don't tell anyone. <laughs> okay, so, oh. should probably do my makeup in this uh, camera because it looks very different on camera versus in person. <laughs> Oof. Anyway, uh, Los is finishing editing. I am gonna go downstairs make an inventory of what we have so I don't double buy. And Let's get the garbage cans out real quick. And then you can do it. Okay, good talk. Mm. Love you, bye baby! Okay, now we're gonna go to the car. And we're gonna go to Costco. Um, guys, it's already so late. It's 9.38, but Costco doesn't open till 10. No, you girls are staying. Um, okay, I'm gonna go. I'll see y'all at Costco. Okay, so we're here at Costco right now. I have like a coupon for a free pizza. So I think I'm gonna go up first and order a big old pizza. So that way by the time I'm out of Costco, it will be ready. It looks awesome. Kinda wanna cheer out, but I'm not gonna do that. Try not to look too creepy doing myself. Um, we always end up with a really full cart. Like, I think I just have a problem. I go really crazy. Anyway, um, I am just about done here. I'm gonna go pick up the pizza that we have ordered, and then I'm gonna go to the grocery store, and then go home. I feel like I'm cooking for a team. Well, I wanted to be able to do a whole video of me like loading the car back when I finished with Costco. But um, when I got to the car, there was a guy waiting for my spot. So I had to just unload as quickly as possible and get out of there so I could give him my spot. But um, something interesting happened while I was checking out. Um, normally when I check out, um, it's a bunch of dudes because it's Costco so a bunch of guys checking like everybody out um, This time it was three women and can I tell you they were so Mean <laughs> like so mean so I didn't dare bring the camera out um, You know, I feel like Unhappy people really just hate it when you smile um, and it almost makes you not want to smile because you don't you don't like how they're treating you or you don't want to make them uncomfortable but i just realized i was like i'm gonna keep being me i'm gonna keep being nice and polite and smile i asked them how their days were and they were just so unhappy now women let me just tell you something <laughs> a mean woman does not make a strong woman it just makes you mean so if you think that being mean means that you are tough and you're strong that is so not correct at all and i feel like a lot of times because in this world like yeah like there are a lot of manly jobs that women have been able to take on now which is awesome but these women who go overboard and just I feel like they try to make up for the fact that they're women when if you if you truly believe in yourself you don't have to make up for anything you just go out there and be awesome and show your strengths and you be kind to people you don't have to be mean and I've seen it a lot in this in, in so many different industries but really a lot in the entertainment industry where instead of women lifting each other up everything is a fight because they're like well it's hard for women to get jobs and you know we have to prove ourselves you guys there's nothing to prove i think we we've all shown that we are strong women we are capable of doing great work so i don't like it when people kind of overcompensate 
for what reason. I feel like there's just a lot of insecurities that you're overcompensating for. So um, it's a very interesting Costco experience. But now I'm here, I'm at Ralph's. I'm gonna go in, get my final few things, and finally go home. It's already been one hour, so I gotta, I'm gonna hustle. Here we go. Okay, I have a loaded back seat, headed home right now. Um, I'm sorry that I'm not giving you guys really eventful stuff. Like I wanted to take you to the grocery store, but I was on a mission. I kind of just had to get my shopping done. So, um, so yes, now I'm headed home. Los just said that he finished editing all the rest of the vlogs, which is so awesome. He's such a rock star. Um, so when I get home, we're going to have a lot of stuff to unload and, um, which is good because I'm starving and all I can smell right now is that amazing pizza that Costco made. So I just want it. I am home. Um, guys, we have so much to unload, so let me go get loaves. Hello! Oh. <gasps> hi, little nugget. Hi, hi, hairy monster. Come on. Come on. Hey, you're so cute. You're so cute. I wish you loved people more. Come here. Come here. Hi. Hi, Sid. Babe. I don't know where he is. Might be in the bathroom. <laughs> What's up guys? We just left uh, Alexa's doctor's uh, doctor's place for the, uh, you know, the baby uh, up inside her. Um, <laughs> Carlos was trying to give himself an ultrasound today. <laughs> yeah, I, <laughs> the, well Doc was doing something and well I just grabbed the ultrasound and tried to do it on my stomach but it didn't work. Carlos also asked the doctor if he could put the GoPro in there to see the no. baby in color. Well because I just got this small GoPro so I thought, <laughs> I thought, I was like, Doc, you stick that big thing in there. What if this little Carlos. tiny GoPro could go in? Maybe we could see his face in color, but um, no. Oh my God. No, that he, he didn't, he did actually he, he giggled. He was he like, was, he <laughs> thought it was funny, but he's like, no. <laughs> uh, but we are on our way to our business manager's place to go sign some papers. Wait, hold on. I'm not done. Our baby is big. We're gonna rewind right now. Yeah, or, uh, yeah, so, um. Our son is a big boy. He's a big boy. He's measuring. He's measuring above. Like 10 days Above early. average. And his head is bigger than, is larger than average, which means no signs of Zika or anything. Ooh. Which is great, because I feel so badly for everyone in Florida, because that is tough right now. That's heartbreaking. Ooh. But um, we are gonna say some prayers and we're gonna just hope and pray that everybody stays safe and on all these babies are just born without any defects. Defects? Is that the right word to say? Defects are just even being affected Genetic by defects. the yeah. Zika virus. It's so whatsoever. sad. Um, but anyways, we are gonna go sign some papers and then we're meeting with um, ah, I dropped my GoPro. And then we're meeting with Alexa's um, uh, manager, who's he's a, a bundle of joy. Later today, Why do you, say that? you will meet Johnny Carabino. Oh, we love Johnny. He's like a. Do you think big he'll do the bear. vlog? One hundred percent. He'll be like, yeah, yeah. One hundred percent. I love John. Yeah, I love him too. I've known him since I was six years old. I've known him since I was twenty-six years old. <laughs> longer than that. No, twenty. Yeah, a little bit longer. Anyways, and we're off. And we're home. Didn't film uh, our little meeting because we forgot the camera in the car, but man, that traffic was awful. I think we were in traffic for like an hour and a half, almost two hours, so it was pretty bad. I was falling asleep, I was hungry, I was getting cranky, Lex was not enjoying that, um, but I get hangry. Uh, but now we're home, and these two little love bugs, well, they, uh, they are wanting to play. Do you guys want to play? Do you guys want to get some energy out? Here's here's an interesting uh, thing. So if I pet Sasha, watch this, and I play with them, Sydney, come here. They start fighting each other. Hi guys. Oh, you're so cute. Oh, come here, Sydney. Oh, oh, oh. Why are you guys? Oh, oh. see there, there they go. Okay. Oh, oh. See, stop fighting each other. Sasha's just a little selfish. 
So she wants me to stay away so she gets you all by herself. Go get her. And then they do this. And I'm like, well, so much for me playing with them. Anyways, we're home. I'm not sure if we vlogged a lot today, but today was kind of a boring, not boring. It was a. Yeah, driving. Yeah, driving. It was, it was a lot of driving. So it was kind of just like a blah day with, with, with driving. Have you but, shown them our packed fridge? Oh, uh, yeah. So from the time lapse earlier, the fridge is packed. Ah. And so is the pantry. And I, I, I just had a, a kiwi that was really sour and my mouth is a little hurting, but it's all good. Um, I think that we're going to go upstairs, uh, finishing finish editing. Uh, another vlog and then probably watch uh, a movie and go to sleep So Lex and I are kind of doing this thing where we get up like really early like 5 30 6 30 And then we have a full day and let me tell you it feels great because it's almost 8 o'clock And I'm exhausted and I like that because that means by 9 30 I'll be asleep kind of getting ready for the baby, you know well I think we at first we won't sleep It's from like that's what I hear and then afterwards, we're here. You know what I was Sleeping thinking? Helps, helps. You know what I was thinking? I was thinking about maybe doing like, like, a daddy, a daddy's vlog. Oh my gosh! Like literally, like how you do your, your, your prego's vlog. Can I ask you a question? Yeah. It's gonna sound so mean. Yeah. But this is like a pregnant lady asking this question. Yeah. What in your life has changed since I got pregnant? <laughs> oh man. I can, I mean, I can tell you a, a couple things like right off the bat um, of that that have changed. Uh -huh. um, but I don't. I feel like we can save that for like another vlog. Okay. You know? So like, yeah. You know what? It's it's. Not... I encourage this daddy vlog. I no, 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 no. But that's not what I mean. I kind of do. I mean right more now. so like if there are any like future dads or current dads or anything out there that I could like legit like have a conversation and be like, yo, here's what I'm going through. Like the baby's getting up, this and that. I feel badly because she's the one do, you know, doing the work. Like what can I do to help her? Like that kind of I stuff. I think you should. The only thing I will say, this is my only complaint. Carlos, you are amazing. I never call him Carlos, but this is how you know I'm getting serious. Ah! I think you are amazing and you are loving and kind and incredible. And I think a daddy vlog is a great, idea but not a, it's not necessarily a but it's a the first three four months of my pregnancy it was awful let me tell you let me tell you how miserable for you me it was zero help in fact you made it harder <laughs> on me you made it harder i did not i did not such thing i hold on i i would never i actually have to like delete this I sometimes make journal entries, but because I won't, I don't have enough time to write it. I'll just like. You made a video of, I, of how bad you were of me. It wasn't a video, but it was a voice memo. Dude, play it. No, play no, it. you do not want me to play it. But it's oh. like the saddest thing oh. ever because I'm literally like I just am so sick. I'm in bed, and you are so angry that I'm sick and in bed. I think it was less of you being <laughs> sick, and I just didn't know. Okay, in you my. Know what to in my defense, I, I didn't know what to do because like we've been so active for so long and all of a sudden it was like can't do this, can't do that, can't do this, can't do that, can't do this, can't do that. I was like in bed all the time. And also in my defense, I, I, I was going to say she but it's we. We don't like being away from each other. So, yeah. I'd, so I'd be like, alright, I'm going to the gym and she'd be like, no I'm coming too. Oh, I feel so sick. Give me 10 minutes. And I'm just like, okay. And then 10 minutes. Okay, here we go. Let's go. Okay, give me 15 more minutes. And I'm like, Yo, woman, just let me go to the gym. And she's like, I don't want to go without you. So we had a lot of that kind of stuff, which, come on, like, look, I, I get it. Trying. It was worse for you, and I thank you for trying, but I'm allowed to have some pain. Totally. Look, I even thought about it today. I was like, it's amazing. Like, you're doing all the work, you're carrying the child. Like, I'm not doing all the work. You're doing a lot. Of, you're no, doing a lot. I did a little bit of work in the beginning, and it, <coughs> that was the fun part. You are carrying, <laughs> you are carrying the child, my angel. You like, it's incredible what you're, I literally thought about it today. I was like, it's incredible what you're doing. Thank you. And like, I, I'll, I'll never understand mm -mm. what these eight months or nine months will have been for you. No. I thought of that today and I was like, good, good on you. So look, before you, you know, listen to that voice note again to remind <laughs> you how awful I am. 
no. or was at the time, and, I, and I'm sorry, I, 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 I didn't mean to. I do appreciate you. I appreciate you so much. Even when you're hungry. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm always hungry because I'm always hungry. All right, let's go get upstairs. This is a long clip, four and a half minutes. Hey guys, it's uh, nine o'clock, hanging. Feels like it's midnight. I think we're about to go to sleep. I'm exhausted. I'm literally just finishing up uh, one of the vlogs and doing some. I'm like learning how to do time lapse with my new little, my new little GoPro camera because it's so awesome. Um, but Alexa is looking up stuff. Guess right. what I did today? What? What did you do today? I officially placed the orders for the new hoodies. Come on, or girl. Pullovers. Whoop. So they should be done. Yeah. In like a week or two. Yeah. And up on our site. I like it. Wait, they should be done in, in a week or two? Mm -hmm. That's exciting. Uh, we are doing some really cool, some, some cool stuff. And Lex ordered a bunch of uh, tank tops that uh, uh, we're going to do a, mm -hmm. a really cool print for uh, Chop Lima. Yeah. Really I got exciting. black tank tops, white tank tops. I got a really cool black pullover, which is so comfortable. Yeah. I think you guys will like that. And the gray one, and too. And then the gray acid wash one. So gray, black tanks and gray and black hoodies. Or not hoodies, but pullovers, which pullovers. are really soft. Those are the um, gifts that you gave to everybody for goodies. They were Those the same. Pullovers? Yeah, they're Those so soft. Good. They are good. Um, but we're excited. You know, I, I already know, and I think that, that uh, we can have what's your face do I'll, I'll do the uh, chop liver first because I already know. You like, see it in your head. Yeah. Thank God. Hold on. Carlos is so talented at everything, and one thing he is always like they make a decision, but it's so hard because he's my teammate. So when I need to make a decision on something, I don't want to. I don't want to do it alone. Like I look to him. Zoom is incredible. I look to him for advice. I don't want to just print something or get something Carlos. I don't want to just get something made and and just I don't want to just do it. And what you come up with is usually better than what I come up with. I love you. I'm just don't get mad for my zoom in. It was for dramatic effect. It was, for dramatic, it was very dramatic. <laughs> but do you see what I mean? Like you're no, like, I totally you do see it, it. and then all of a sudden you're like, I see something. I totally that's see why it. I don't want to do it alone. No, 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 but you can ask me and I'll give you my opinion. Well, like, how about this? When I came up with the cross your heart idea, yeah. we loved that idea, so we went with it. But you had another vision for it, which I'm really excited about. And, like, I would rather continue to, like, work as a team to create these things. I love you. <laughs> I think that I just like my brain is always going and like when you talk you talk very slowly and you want to point to and get you want to get every single detail across and you want to make sure that everybody knows you're wearing blue shoes and a pink sweater oh, I don't know. and Today, a little I was talking to you trying to communicate with you and you're just in there on your phone so finally I was like are you listening to me how rude what do you mean am I even listening to you yes I'm <laughs> listening to you well, no one would know baby. you were listening to I love to you, me. baby. So we're here in bed. We're, we're going to watch some Camp Cutthroat. It's kind of... It's okay. I mean, Cutthroat Kitchen is way better, but Camp Cutthroat, I mean, it's okay, right? Yeah. Alexa doesn't like it. I'll be back. I appreciate you. I appreciate you. appreciate you so much. So much. All right. Um, I'm going to put the doggies up. I'm going to actually let them out to go to the bathroom. Who wants to go potty? Who's got to go potty? Who's got, oh, Sasha's like, me, 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 me. Who's got to go potty? Ah! Uh, oh, hello, come on. Oh, ow, I just tripped. Uh, all right, here we go, okay. See, we, we try and train them to not get close to the door. Back up, come on, Sydney, back up. Over here, yep, seats. There we go, seats. Sydney, wait. Wait for it. Wait, uh, 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 wait. Go body. Go 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 go. And then we have a little, a little tiny grassy area, and they go to the bathroom, and then they come back. Off to bed. They're gonna close up the little kitchen. Though I'm hungry right now, and I shouldn't eat, but man, what a day! 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 What a day. Oh man, 
We went to the doctor to see the baby. He's great. We drove in lots of traffic for 24 hours. It felt like 24 hours. I got hangry. We met with your manager. He got hangry. He was really nice. He gave us some good advice. And um, what else did we Why do? Why is it so yellow? I don't know. I don't know, but it's fine. What else did we do? Um. Oh my gosh, I went on a huge you Costco run. You did the huge Costco run. And we, grocery store run. We posted two vlogs. You did that. So while I went and did And we got up stuff, at 6, 6.30. Oh, sorry yeah. to cut you off. No. And we watched Cutthroat Kitchen in the morning and tonight. It was a good day. I don't like Cutthroat Kitchen Camp right Cutthroat now. Kitchen. I don't like it. It's okay, baby. It's the old one. It actually, We're going to get back. It's actually boring. <laughs> <laughs> Hater. Uh, anyways, uh, ho hope you guys had a great day. Um, we're loving doing these vlogs at home. It's been fun. Can't wait for tomorrow. What's tomorrow gonna bring? I don't know. What do we do tomorrow? We got meetings. We got stuff. Who yeah, cares? we have a meeting. We'll tomorrow. figure it out. We have an interview tomorrow. Is it with me too? Yeah. Ooh, I got the interview. Get to um, interview. Let's see. What did we learn today? Words of wisdom. Well. Eat I before learned. you get in the car so you don't get hangry with traffic. <laughs> I learned that. I learned something. Tell me. It was really cool. And I never actually really realized it before today. Oh. And I said it to you and I also said it to Johnny. Um, oh, yes. So. You're welcome. Carlos is a great husband. I, um, in all of my life, no one has ever really asked me what I wanted. Except for me. I'm getting there. Mostly. Oh, sorry, sorry, yeah. sorry. Um, growing up, I lo like I love this industry. I love my family. But growing up, like you just kind of do, you know, everything for other people, or at least I did. And then as I got older and I got into relationships, I would always do everything for the other person. And even if it wasn't something that I necessarily wanted to do, I knew that those are like sacrifices that you make and and yeah so anyway carlos keeps asking me he's like well babe what do you want to do what do you want to do and so many things whether it's a restaurant or a house or like they, it goes from little things to big things he always asks me and i usually go i refer back to him like no well, what do you want to do and then whatever he says and i'm like okay then that let's do that you know and i'm very happy about it but it did make me realize that you know he really was like no what do you want? Because we're kind of going back and forth on do we move? Do we stay here? Like, where do we want to raise ocean? Just kind of all these questions. He's asking me, he's like, babe, what do you want? And I realized that I didn't even know. I didn't know the answer to that question, which meant that I didn't even know what to be praying for or like what goals I should be setting on my own because I was so concerned, I guess, or caught up in kind of people pleasing? Would that be people pleasing? Which is not good. Do you have anything to say on that? Uh, sorry, I, I, was, I, was, I was listening. He wasn't listening. And, no, no, I was listening and then trying to see how, how we can tie it into like words of wisdom for the evening. Well, no, I think, I think the words of wisdom is do not people please. You need to be in prayer constantly about kind of things that are going on in your life but you also really need to have a sense of direction for, for yourself. I mean, we want, we're a team, so everything we do is together, but I have to be in addition to that team. I can't just be a cheerleader. I have to be a part of this team, and that means making decisions as well. And it's hard because when the decision-making is on you, you don't wanna make the wrong decision, so I usually leave it in Carlos's hands and then just support him, but, um, I also know that sometimes making decisions can sometimes lead to conflict and I don't like conflict. So I'm avoiding important things because I can't just go, okay, what is it that I want? And um, yeah, I hope that it, all of this makes sense. Just line your heart up with the word and, and just pray about it, but go to God with a plan. Be like, God, this is this is what I want. Does this line up with what you want for me? Because sometimes it won't, and he'll redirect your heart. But at least go to him with a plan, not just being lazy 
and like, okay, cool, whatever happens, happens. I'll just sit back and wait. You have to be proactive. Well, amen to that. Did that make any sense? Total, totally, totally made sense. It makes sense in my brain. I don't it makes I sense never in, know when in, it makes sense. In the world of vlogs, it in does. In life. Uh, well, tomorrow's another day, and we are praying for you guys. We love you guys, and uh, well, we're back home. You're so cute. I love, you're cute. I love you. Um, <laughs> sorry, I, I was going to say, oh, I love you, but then I was like, you're cute. I love you. <laughs> that was weird. Um, all right, let, let's go to sleep. And of course, always, always. You love me. What? Chocolate! I was gonna say. <laughs> that was like a, like a weird like Chinese version. <laughs> Chocolate! <laughs> but like, like it being like a Chinese movie, like. Chocolate! <laughs> Can we just stop? Good night. <laughs>